y'all it is a beautiful morning it's gorgeous out today it's like a Monday morning um, we're gonna go check out Mars Hill today this is what I've been wanting to do and this is really exciting because this is my first town visit tour vlog since before coronavirus happened so this is gonna be the first one in over a year um, I'm gonna go actually visit a town get some lunch and uh, tell you more about the town like I used to a long time ago back before the uh, end times so I'm super excited about this uh, vlog. It's gonna be freaking awesome. Mars Hill's a really cool town just outside of North uh, Asheville, North Carolina um, with a great little day trip kind of destination if you're in the area and visiting. So um, stay tuned, we're gonna get into that. I'm Parker Brewer and I follow the roads less traveled. I like my mountains rugged and my waterfalls refreshingly frigid. Subscribe and come along with me on the adventure. into Mars Hill um, oh it's really sunny I'm gonna look super yellow and we're gonna go check out the downtown and um, there's a museum that I thought was only open like Thursday through Saturday but it looks like it's open daily so we are gonna get to check that out in the end I'm pretty excited about that um, so I'll tell you more about that as we get there um, we're also gonna grab some lunch as well and then I haven't found a brewery to check out yet but I know that the lunch place we're going to has local beer so we're gonna check that out all right y'all this is Mars Hill North Carolina y'all so we've been walking around mars hill and i gotta tell you there's actually like not a ton here it's kind of more like an afternoon trip come out for lunch walk around the campus of mars hill university is beautiful and pretty much is the town it dominates the town there is like a main street but i don't know if it's the covid that's happened or if it's just what's going on here but there's really not a lot going on in downtown mars hill um not really any stores to check out. Some restaurants, which we're gonna go check out in a second here. We're gonna eat at Stack House at noon, but um, they don't open until noon right now during the COVID. Um, so yeah, it's kind of a thing. It's like a pretty place to come and hang out. They do have a disc golf course if you play disc golf, um, but definitely not a full day trip kind of thing. Maybe uh, hit here for lunch and then head up into the mountains to do some hiking or just come out here if you're do looking for like a really chill day, grab some lunch and walk around and just enjoy the weather because it's beautiful. There's just not, not much going on. Anyway, so we're going to check out this um, Rural Heritage Museum that's here. Um, that's got some stuff about the mountains around here, Appalachian Mountain kind of history. And then grab some lunch at Stackhouse. And uh, 
I think we're gonna finish it up after that, but y'all stay tuned. <laughs> well, on par for the course, uh, the restaurant or the museum is actually closed. Um, I guess the website is more accurate than the sign they have hanging out front. It's not open daily, or at least it's not open today. I don't know when it's open. The website was not very clear. The best I could see was that it's open like Thursday through Saturday, but I'm gonna link the website down here so you guys can check on that yourself. It's supposedly a really cool museum. Um, we did find an art show across the street, so we're gonna go check that out instead, but I'm not gonna vlog any of that because I don't wanna um, give away the artist's like, work or anything like that. Kind of a no-no. Um, but I will check back in with you when it's time for food. Y'all stay tuned. All right, we went back to the car because we're trying to kill a little time before the restaurant opens because it doesn't open until noon. And uh, it's like 11.50 now or something. So we're going to reposition the car back closer to where the restaurant is and uh, go check it out. This place we're going to, like I said, is Stack House. I'm going to link it beneath me um, in the description. So y'all, if you're coming up to Marshall for some food, definitely check it out. Um, local food, local beer. Uh, gonna be tasty. Um, I'll let you all know how it is. Um, we're heading there right now. Marcel. So freaking good. Um, hot take, but their barbecue is actually better than Buxton Hall. If you guys are familiar with Asheville, you know Buxton Hall is like the ranting and raved about place to go get barbecue. Their barbecue is better. It actually has like flavor in its meat. Um, so definitely make your way out here for some lunch, if not anything else. I think we're going to call it here because there really isn't much else going on in Mars Hill. Um, I imagine when there's no COVID and during the summer there's actually a lot more. There is like the Southern Appalachian Repertory Theater, Repertory Theater here um, and they do a lot of stuff in the summertime with performances, especially during the COVID times, um, well before the COVID times and I hopefully they will come back to doing that again. Um, but yeah, this place is cool. Definitely a great like afternoon stop. Maybe grab some lunch on your way up to Burnsville for hiking or something like that, but um, it's beautiful. I'm gonna go ahead and call it here and just remind y'all to uh, like the video and subscribe to the channel because I'm doing stuff like this pretty much all the time and uh, hoping for some really cool adventures coming up in the next couple months. So y'all stay tuned and I will see y'all next week.